A Hendersonville child is nursing a gunshot wound tonight after an accidental shooting. The police say it happened in a home where two juveniles were left alone. News 13's Frank Carboni joins us with more. So, Frank, how is the child doing tonight? Well, police say the wound was not life-threatening, but this accident could have had a deadly outcome, and now someone could face charges. We got a call at uh, 5.32 um, in the evening. The call was about a shooting at this home at 308 Resort Street in South Hendersonville. There was two juveniles left alone in a home. Um, one of the juveniles was able to gain access to a firearm and there was an accidental discharge. One of the juveniles was struck and taken to a local hospital emergency room where someone called police. Non-life threatening injuries, the other, one of the juveniles was taken to the hospital, uh, was taken to party hospital, then later taken to mission um, and I believe she was released. Police say this accident could have had deadly consequences. The gun used was a Smith & Wesson 38 like this one. Investigators are now looking at how the juvenile got a hold of that gun and whether someone will face charges. In North Carolina, it's against the law to allow an unsupervised minor access to a firearm, part of the law designed to keep guns locked up and away from children. There's probably enough evidence to charge the parents for, with some type of criminal violation, um, but we would consult the district attorney's office before we do anything further. Police say the charge for violating the safe gun storage law in North Carolina is a class one misdemeanor, but they say more charges could also be filed in this case.